Hello guys, welcome to Amit Things. In this video, we will learn about the check constant in SQL. So, as the name suggests, the check constant is basically used to allow only a certain values for a column. Let's say you need to limit the value range which you place in a column. Let's say the value in case of age records, you want to insert the record of students with age less than 20 only. So, you will use the check constant while creating the table. With that, let's say another example. You want to insert records of employees with salaries less than 10,000 only in a table. So, you can set the check constant while creating the table and while defining the column salary. Let's see a live example. Herein, you can see we have our SQL server, the databases are visible. We have AmitDB database. Okay, so let us enter AmitDB database. Click on execute. Query executed successfully. We are inside the AmitDB database. Now let us create a table and set a check constraint for it. I told you, let's say I'll go for create table employee that is an employee table. So herein you can see we have employee ID, employee name, city and salary. Employee ID we have set not null and primary key. So here is the salary. We want to set a check constraint so that only the records with salary less than 10,000 gets inserted. So for that, let us set the check. This will depict the check constant and herein salary less than 10,000. Okay, that's it. So we have set the check constant. Now what I'll do, I'll just create the table, click on execute and table created successfully. Now what I'll do, I'll just insert the records. Okay, and we'll show you a live example again. So herein I have inserted two records. So these are two rows with ID, employee name, city and salary. Salary is less than 10,000. So there won't be any error when I'll insert it. Let's say I inserted it. I will execute after selecting. You can see queries executed successfully. You can see here rows affected. Now let us print the records. I hope you know to display all the records from a table. We use select star from employee. That is select star from, from table name. Click on execute. You can see we have inserted two records. Salary is less than 10,000. So there is no error. Now let's say I'll insert a record with salary greater than 10,000. Then it will show an error. Okay. So let us add it. Here in I'll add three. Name, let us add will. Uh, location, we can add any, any random location. Now that's it. 8000. So I'll set 10, 11,000 here, but the check constant depicts that the salary should be less than 10,000. So there will be an error definitely. Let's add execute. You can see query completed with errors and the error will depict the check constant. You can see the insert statement conflicted with the check constant. Definitely yes. The conflict occurred in database AmitDB and column salary as I told you before. Okay, it's all about salary because we inserted a salary which is over the check constant mark. Okay, so what I can do, I can just change it to 1000 or uh, let's say 5500 instead. Now when I'll, I'll run it, there won't be any error. Execute, you can see one row affected. Okay, now I can straight away, it's good, yeah. I can straight away run it now. And let's see the third value will get inserted easily with salary 5500. So all these salaries are less than or check constant that is less than 10,000. In this way, you can use the check constant in SQL. So guys, in this video, we saw what is the usage of check constant in SQL and how you can use it in your table. So guys, thank you for watching the video. If you liked it, do subscribe to our channel Amit Things.